says, hi, Felicia here, not by Felicia. So um, today I'm trying out a new Jamaican restaurant that's in our Trumbull Mall. It's called Corbean, Corbean, I don't know, K-O-R-B-E-A-N. So that's the name of the restaurant. So we're gonna say our grace and I'll tell you what we have. So I have some jerk chicken, I think, pasta, collard greens, yams, um, curry chicken, corn on the cob, jerk shrimp, the jerk shrimp, and what's this? Some macaroni and cheese, some Parmesan macaroni and cheese, and cabbage. So we're gonna try. I wanted some curry goat, but they only have bones. Mm. The curry chicken is good. Mmm. Mmm. I like the curry chicken. Let's try the jerk. Shrimp. I'm gonna put a plate right here so we can catch that drip. See that shrimp? Mmm. Good. Try the cabbage. That's good. I'm trying everything, guys. Because people going to want to know. This is the mac and cheese. Mmm. Yeah. The mac and cheese. So let me. My daughter didn't want to be in the video, guys. I know you guys want to see more of the girls, but I can't force them. Want some more of this? Okay. Hi, guys. That pasta is really good. This one? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm The mac is good too. Mm. I mean, yeah, the pasta in the mac. It's spicy too. It says jerk. You can taste that jerk. They have a little mushroom. A little sweet flavor, but it's very, very spicy and cheesy. and cheesy. Let's try the collard greens. Mm. Uh oh. Uh oh. The collard greens. I think somebody. Poured a little bit too much salt on them. Y'all know I like salt, but I can see the salt right here. So I might put, put a little bit too much salt on that. There's a lot of salt on there. So I'm not gonna eat those. Yeah. Too much salt, guys. Too much salt. Mm. The yams are okay. I mean, I like my yams. It's like a bunch of 
mad nutmeg on it. I like nutmeg, but that's a lot. That's a lot of nutmeg. I think these are candy yams. Those look like canned yams. I do like this jerk pasta, jerk chicken pasta. But the collard greens are way too salty. I think somebody just made a mistake. Other than that, it would be good without all that salt. Okay, let's try this corn on the cob. Looks like they grill it. Mm. It's corn on the cob. Mm. I don't know. Oh, I my tea. Let's get back to the shrimp. These aren't too spicy. They said jerk. Jerk shrimp. But it's not too spicy. The mac and cheese is really good. Mm mm. Dropping food, y'all. over here and that's the jerk mm -hmm. I know you guys can't see it because that light is too bright mm. I'm done with that I really wanted some goat. <clears throat> but they only have bones. That was funny because I was playing with them. I said, I want some goat, not bones. And he couldn't give it to me because it was just, it was like all bones. Mm -mm. So they don't, mm. they don't have a menu out just yet, but they'll have one out next week. They have so many options. I don't know what those options are, but, um, oh, they have fried chicken. They have rice, white rice, some yellow seasoning rice. Um. I'm pretty upset that the collard greens are over salted. I can see the salt on top of the greens. I don't know if you can see it, but I can see the greens. Yeah, anywho. The cabbage is good. Okay, guys. I think that was my review. I think I'm done with my review. Overall, I think it's a good start for a new Jamaican restaurant to be open in the mall. Um, 
they have a lot of, you know, preparation to do and stuff. So I think they'll get it together and, um, you know, have the demands, the mall demands. Um, so hopefully they see this video and I'll let them know that someone oversalted the collard greens. I think they had to do it by mistake because it looked like they just put it on there or something. So yeah, and um, the jerk pasta was good. The shrimp, the cabbage, the mac and cheese, the yams has just too much, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of um, nutmeg, as you can see. Yeah, too nutmeggy. So, I'm going with that. Yeah, I don't know if they have different chefs there who's the cook or whatever, but you guys, I'll let them know. Because I told them I was doing a review, so I will let them know personally. Okay? So, because we're going to get it together. Because it's cool to have, you know, black-owned business, businesses and stuff, restaurants to support and in the mall period okay guys so you know what to do don't forget to like oh wait i'm going yet mm -hmm. sorry i want to say we hit 3k subscribers i hit 3k and i thank you guys so much you guys have been coming over supporting me because i did that review on b loves i know some most of you guys came from b love and I appreciate it, appreciate it, appreciate it. So um, I have a question for you guys. How long do you want my videos to be? It seems like when you do seafood boys, it's so long because you're opening and cracking and stuff like that. But I may need to do de-shelled ones or something because it's just too long. Um, so what video length would you want to see? 15, 20 minutes. I don't know right now. This is going at 12, almost 13 minutes. So, uh, and that's because I was doing this re 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 review. So, um, you guys, let me know. Hit me up in the comments. And what else do you want me want to see me eat? I know I have to do a seafood boil, another seafood boil soon. I have mussels. I also have some... Um, Lord, I have some um, little baby octopus. We're going to try them again, but these are the, they're frozen already. So anyway, guys, I got my nails done. I got that nail fixed. I don't know if you can see. Oh, here. I think you almost, almost had it. You see that? It's pink. Because I'm not going to be going back. So October is breast cancer month. So I always get pink. So I know my nails are still gonna be mm, like this for October. So these are my nails. I hope you like them. Okay guys, so that concludes the video. So don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And keep those post notifications on so when I upload, upload a new video, you know when they're available. Or you can watch me. You can be that first one to comment. I love you all. Mm -hmm.